We're back! Alright, you're making a huge mistake. Hemlock is the worst wood to screw into. We're gonna have to drill holes for every single one that we put in. Yeah, and it's also the best wood for mm, durability, color, effect. It's certainly better than the ebony that you wanted us to get from the Peruvian rainforest. Save the rainforest. Yeah. If we really wanted to be eco-friendly about this, we wouldn't be doing a whole entire new room instead of staying in the old space. You know how the old space was so great, wasn't it? The moisture, the bugs, the dankness, the spider webs. It was just excellent, wasn't it? Look, up here at least we have the opportunity, maybe some curtains, some colors, some contrast, some sconces. Sconces? What's wrong with the classic torch mount? What's wrong with the classic torch mount? You're medieval! Because I don't think that window treatments are appropriate to have in a torture chain. Guys. Old space, new space, what does it matter? As long as friendship is key in this whole equation, everyone's a winner. I'm done for today. Good luck on the inspection, boys! Inspection's next week. Tell me you cleaned out the basement. Tell me you cleaned out the old space. Tell me that you cleaned out the old space. Tell me that you cleaned out the old space. And let you talk me into using X drive screws to mount the operation chair. Well, maybe you were thinking, fine, I'll let someone with actual clarity of vision call the shots for once. Oh, and hi, a butt pad? Seriously? Who's gonna be scared when they sit down on this thing and there's a butt pad for them? It's torture for me to look at an unconsidered piece of decor. No, for real, the last guy that we had down here, he saw this and was like, oh, this is what you're gonna kill me, and he was like laughing a little bit. I saw him. If someone tried to force me into a chair with pleather straps, I'd be laughing too. It's ready. Have you, have you even thought about the logistical problems of having an acid bath on the second floor? Look, I like it up there. There's gonna be the skylight eventually, there's gonna be the world top, there's every reason in the world to have the acid cauldron upstairs. That's more bags that we're gonna have to haul upstairs to deal with those nasty little chunks of flesh that stick to the side. Is this a residence of Ivan Wright? Actually, he's an eighth Slovakian, so he pronounces it Ivan Wright. More like Ivan Wrong. Can we just get this inspection underway? This is a violation. Do you think this is a game? This completely fails. Is this the drain mentioned in your report? It is. I remember it myself. I actually come from a long line of crafts. where your drain is. It's not standard. Um, that is a hook that we hang deer on after we've gone hunting. We have to drain the juices out. This doesn't match. That's exactly what I said. How do you explain this? Well, that room is, you see, what we use that for is, uh, the thing that we use that for is that when Ricky's been naughty and he needs me to help him to remember how not to be naughty, well, um, yes, that's what it's for. Um, he dresses me up like a sailor and hoses me off and makes me say, it's, it feels bad, mommy. It feels bad. It feels bad. I'm not really here to judge, except for the house, which fails. We've got 60 days to get this place squared away. Ricky, I don't really care if it's the old space or the new space. 
What I care about is that our friendship remains intact. Yvonne, all I care about is cutting up these college girls and transients in the right way. Together! Together. They'll have one more body to melt down in the acid tub downstairs. <laughs> Yvonne, I don't think this was such a huge mistake after all.